Public submissions are now open as a parliamentary committee examines planning processes in Newcastle and the Hunter. It follows startling ICAC revelations about political donations to Hunter MPs and concerns about the influence of developers. Representatives of community groups met with Greens MLC David Shoebridge today discussing how the parliamentary committee will operate and how best to present their case. There is enormous community disquiet about these key planning decisions and we will be looking deeply into it. Mr Shoebridge is one of six on the committee appointed by the New South Wales Upper House. Along with submissions, public hearings will be held in November. Surveying work has already started for the truncation of Newcastle's rail line, despite calls to halt the project until after the by-elections and inquiry. There's a desperation in this government to change the reality on the ground before there's been this integrity test of planning decisions in the Hunter. In the interests of probity and good governance, this state government needs to call a halt to all of those developments. The high rise, the closure of the railway. Mr Shoebridge claims crossbenchers Craig Bowman and Gary Edwards should resign. Previously, members like this would have been shamed out of office by the evidence that we heard in ICAC. But instead, they continue to draw a salary. Jane Goldsmith, NBN News.